Here are the series of events to develop a new drug. This story takes years to and costs a lot of money. It all starts with what we call preclinical trials. Preclinical trials involve animal testing. In addition, nowadays we use computer models and isolated human stem cells to try the effect of this drug. If we succeed in the preclinical trials, we start in human trials. Now, the first trials take place on healthy humans, and that's what we call phase one of drug trials. There are three phases of drug trials, phase two and phase three. In phase one, as we said, we're going to start with healthy human volunteers. Our main purpose here is to see if there is any major side effects. So those healthy volunteers are given low dose of the medicine. We then move to the clinical trials to phase two. During phase two, we try the medicine on patients for the first time. We're still checking for side effects. In addition, we're trying to see how effective the drug is. In phase three, we increase the sample size of patients and we try the drug now to see whether if it's more effective than existing drugs in the market. If we succeed in all three phases, we pass on to the next phase where we submit our result to the drug association. If they approve, then we will release this into the market, but we would still hear feedback from patients, pharmacists, and doctors on how effective the drug is.